Walt Disney, character, Walt Disney, uh, personage Disney. Alors, pour ça, on a besoin de papier et un crayon, et de paper and a pencil, mais aussi, on va essayer de faire un petit peu de papier. Okie dokie, now guys, pencil up in the air, please, le crayon est s'il vous plaît. Oh, do another one, you can see me turn up his like We go the other side, and then just to make sure that everything works, we do the whole arm of it, tout le bras, si ça tombe, il y a un problème. Okay, there you go, very good. We've got all of this. What are we going to do? Now, at the end, your drawing is supposed to look like this, okay? Now, if you want to do that, you can resemble it. So, I look at the piano. Keep it in mind, because I'm not going to cast it. I'm going to hide it. I'm not going to cast it. Not a problem. Take all together. We will draw our own together. Is it by the procedure to do it? It's not difficult at all. Now, of course, I think it's really easy. Let's start with two lines. Now, the first one. Go from top to bottom, straight down the middle. The O and back on plan B, and come up like this. The second one is horizontal, but also in the middle. We see on the mirror, the center is horizontal. Voila! Oh, on a croix. Oh, we've got a cross. Next, we're going to stick a circle underneath this line with that one in the middle. On va coller un cercle en dessous de notre ligne horizontale, mais avec cette ligne au milieu. Et pour faire cela, on va faire notre cercle en quatre parties. To do that. Our circle in four parts. So with very thin lines, we're going to sketch. With the line leisure, on va esquisser. On fait un, deux, trois, et quatre. Et après, on tourne et on tourne. And we go round and round until we have our circle. Now, as soon as you've got your circle, you're going to cut it in four with a horizontal line that stays parallel to the first one. Then, on va faire notre cercle. On va le couper en quatre avec une autre ligne horizontale qui reste parallèle à la première. We take the space of the circle. On prend l'espace du cercle et on le pose sur notre ligne de haut. We put it on our top line. That gives us a little indication of where we need to be. On fait petit trait là pour ça, on sait où on va aller. Alors, comme on avait fait pour le cercle, cette fois-ci on va faire un ballon de rugby. This time we're going to do a rugby ball. And like we did for the circle, we do it in four parts. Comme on avait fait pour notre cercle, on le fait en quatre parties. Et on fait un, deux, trois, et quatre. Ballon de rugby. And like we did for the circle, right in the middle, we do another line. On plein milieu, on en fait une autre ligne qui aussi reste parallèle au premier. That one needs to stay parallel to the first one as well, like this. Oh, yes, we we'll start with the nose. <laughs> Alors, commence avec le nez qui fait en deux parties. It's made out of two parts. So now, the first part, the première partie, the demi cercle à l'envers, an upside down half circle, like this. Comme ceci, très léger, very light. Then the second part, the second part, is the U, a letter U that we attach to a half circle. On attach our two demi circle, like that. And when we attach the two, we put it on the line to make sure it works. As soon as you put the two together, you can open the lines again. So it stands out. And we add a little line at the bottom. 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 Donut. Let's do a donut, everyone. We start off with a small curved line on either side. On fait petite ligne courbe de chaque côté, là et là. Then we do a big round shape. On va faire un énorme rond qui ne doit surtout pas toucher notre ligne horizontale. We don't want to touch our horizontal line, everyone. Hold on, I'll go over the lines again so you can see. Je vais repasser sur mes lignes pour que vous voyez bien les deux. Je vais laisser de l'espace ici, un left space here. Okay. That's very important because we need to attach the mouth. If you have the labus, pour la bouche, on fait deux petites demi circle We do a very small half circle. And if we've done this right, we should have the cross right in the middle of the mouth. Si on a bien fait, on devra avoir le droit en plein milieu de la bouche, comme ça. Our guest put our service to the test. Tie a napkin round to an injury and we provide you. Nose. 
Passou, tá de certo, olha, quando faz o que é. Não, isso passa o tempo, não. Como lá, não, 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 E essa tracita com a passão de linha ou mande tudo certo para ver. This time when we come over the lines, we take the whole circle with us. Look at this. The cheeks and the chin. On a lixo, e no ponto de ouro, porque só o tempo de vida para que já. On top of that, we just finish the bottom half of his face. Well done, you're fit. And that means, of course, that we still need to do the top. So we need to fulfil our little. It was our goals and it will be. Let's start with the pupils. They're hanging from our horizontal line. We saw the suspended the nut and in the horizontal. No fake do petit olive arm. You two little black olives that don't touch the nose. You are quite too shy in the neck. Les just au dessus on fait deux lignes courbes d'expression. We do two small curved lines above our little uh, olives and they're there for expression. Now, since these are just the pupils, we need to do the rest of the eyes. Now, for about the rest of the eyes, you can see the pupils. And we're going to do two angles on the line. Right on top, in the middle, we're going to do two curved lines back to back. We're going to do two lines back to back. Do and do, like this. And now, my favorite part, we cheat. My number is my favorite, and we cheat. We have the lines very light. We do very, very thin lines. And one, the two first ones will stay parallel to our rugby ball. Everyone, there we go. Very light. 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 And when we find the right shape, we can move the body forward. On the pass, we are sure to lean in, sure to lean in. Of course, it's only when we're sure to have the right shape that we go over the lines again. Et voilà, les yeux et les sourcils. There we go, guys. Eyes and eyebrows. And this is not bad, but it looks a bit weird because we're still missing the ears. Il nous manque encore les oreilles, c'est pour ça que ça fait un peu bizarre. Alors pour les oreilles, on va faire deux œufs. We're going to do two eggs. To do eggs, we go round and round. On tourne et on tourne très léger, very light. On va rentrer légèrement dans la balle de rugby. We go sliding inside the rugby ball, everyone. Like this. Don't see. Let's go over a few lines first. Here, next to the eyebrows. I'm going to take the sourcil of the line that you follow the line. Then the ears, but only the part that's outside the rugby ball, because the part that is at the exterior of the ball of the line. Et maintenant, on va commencer trois fois du même endroit. Now we're going to start three times from the same spot. Now those spots are right here where the line cuts the oval. Là où la ligne coupe, on va commencer trois fois. Alors, première fois, first part. Ligne courbe qui reste parallèle. We do a curved line that stays parallel. Ça nous donne la forme de l'oreille. That gives the shape of the ear. Now, to show the inside is hollow, we have a small curve of line. On montre avec un petit ligne courbe que l'intérieur est creux. And then we do the sides here. On fait ce côté là. Pour ça, on va tout droit vers le milieu de notre joue. We go straight down to the middle of the cheek. Et voilà, on a la forme du visage. There we go. We've got the whole shape of his face, everyone. Which means we can finally add all the things that made the tiger a tiger. Et on va pouvoir finalement rajouter toutes les choses qui font le tigre ou le tigre. Et on commence avec ces lignes. Let's start with the stripes. Pour le tigre, ça va être des triangles. Pour le tigre, ses stripes sont en fait des triangles. 
So we do a triangle on either side of the eyes and we color it in nice and dark. You know, the Pulori, Via Fosse, comes to see like this. Then on top of his cheeks, we do a big one and a small one. What there and Pompe a petit sur le de jour. He gives you full of full of you see. Of course, we need to color those in as well. And let's not forget the eyebrows. For what we believe this is Les poulets ceci, on fait un zigzag et rapide qu'on commence d'un côté, on zigzag par là. Le haut et on descend de l'autre côté, we go and start on one side and we zigzag all the way around the top and down the other side. And of course, last but not least, on the dernier, les moustaches, the whiskers. Il y en a trois de chaque côté, il y en a three on either side of the nose, everyone, which makes us go one, two, three. Un, deux, trois, et voilà, on a fini notre tigou. There we go, we just finished our tigger, everyone. Yay! And now that we're all artists, we need to sign our masterpiece, of course. Bien sûr, maintenant, on est tous des artistes qui vont falloir signer ce chef d'œuvre. Alors, on va marquer notre nom en bas de la page. We put our name at the bottom of the page. We add today's date. On ajoute la date d'aujourd'hui, on est le 11 mai. 2022, 2022. Uh, that's Charlotte's and that's Perry's. Okay.